we went from uh, the Maasai Mara to um, to Las Vegas, and on the surface, I mean, obviously, it was it was an absolute culture shock. And you just you realize that it 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 it, it holds a mirror up to us more than anything else. So I think that transition was was absolutely shocking, and then going from Las Vegas to Lake Mead. To see how one thing can impact another in such clear, tangible, visual terms. But the relationship between the two was really, really striking. And then combined with the fact that you're, you're standing on one of the most magnificent uh, infrastructures that you, get, you can't believe that someone conceived of this and you're in complete awe of American ingenuity at its best and you think my god I mean when 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 people get together and try to find solutions that are that, and, and make them happen to the extent that they did with Hydro Dam at the uh, the Hydro Dam it's it's completely breathtaking and then at once it's an outdated model that clearly needs to be um, rethought okay well we're going to this is where we'll interview Sandra um, Sandra is interesting because she's so well spoken, but she, you know she's not like an activist per se. She's not like a lobbyist. She's very down to earth, and she has she's kind of the spokesman for water issues, but she is pretty blunt and she just you know says what she wants to say and refreshingly honest. I really quite quite liked it. And she she's not like pitching anything. She's just. It's almost like she's just someone who's curious and passionate about water. Well, first of all, you're meeting someone who is of a, a completely different caliber. I mean, I don't, I wouldn't even pretend that I could, I could relate to her intelligence. She's clearly, you know, wildly articulate and is able to connect complex scientific issues um, with human experience and explain them in a way to people that they're compelling and moving. And that's a really rare thing.